After weeks of intense training, Goku had finally mastered his new transformation, Super Saiyan 10. He had discovered how to quickly fuse with the Dragon Balls, accessing that power without needing long periods of meditation. Each day of training brought more control, precision and above all, confidence in his ability to maintain this form. He knew he was ready, but he also knew that his greatest test was yet to come. It was during a quiet afternoon, while resting after yet another rigorous training session, that he felt something that immediately put him on alert. A familiar presence, oppressive and full of malice, was rapidly approaching Earth. Goku was silent for a moment, feeling the growing Kai. There was no doubt, it was Frieza, Goku's heart raced. The encounter he knew was inevitable was finally about to happen. Frieza was more powerful than ever, just as Shenron had said, but now Goku had also surpassed his own limits. He felt a mixture of excitement and seriousness. The confrontation with his archenemy would not be just a physical battle. It would be a clash of wills, of evolution, where both were at their peaks. Wasting no time, Goku shot through the sky, leaving his training ground in the mountains and heading towards the exact point from which Frieza's energy radiated. As he approached, the sky around him began to change, dark clouds forming and thunder echoing through the atmosphere. Frieza's arrival seemed to influence even the Earth's very weather, as if the universe recognized the imminence of an epic duel. In a matter of minutes, Goku landed on a vast plain. The terrain was deserted and silent, but the tension in the air was palpable. On the horizon, a small spaceship could be seen landing gently on the ground. The ramp of the ship opened, and from within it, Frieza emerged, floating in the air with a cruel smile plastered on his face. Goku, said Frieza, his voice icy and calculating. It's been a while, hasn't it? I hope you enjoyed your last moments of peace. Goku landed on the ground in front of him, his serious gaze fixed on the tyrant. Frieza, I knew you were training, but I must warn you. This time, you're dealing with a completely different Goku. Frieza's smile widened. Oh, I look forward to seeing how much you've improved, Saiyan. But don't think your efforts will change the outcome. This time, I'm invincible. Without another word, Goku and Frieza stared at each other in silence, their powers beginning to flow to the surface. The wind around them began to blow harder as the two titanic forces prepared for the clash. This was the moment they had both been waiting for for a long time. The fate of the planet and perhaps the universe depended on this battle. Goku clenched his fists and took a deep breath. It's time to see how far you've come, Frieza! The clash of the arch enemies was about to begin. Frieza was floating in mid-air, before Goku his expression cold and disdainful. Up until now, he had remained in his base form, not showing the power he had been accumulating during his intense training. However, when he realized that there was no other choice in what he considered to be a final confrontation with his arch nemesis, a malicious smile formed on his face. I see you came prepared, Goku, Frieza said, his voice thick with arrogance but it is time for you to witness the true power I have attained. Without further ado, Frieza began to unleash his energy. The ground beneath him began to crack, and the air around him grew thick with the immense power that was building up. The glow of his aura became dark and menacing, contrasting with the sheer strength that radiated from his body. Slowly, his form began to change, his skin turning dark, almost black, and a metallic sheen shimmered around its edges. This was his most powerful transformation, the form he had named Black Frieza. Goku watched the transformation closely, immediately recognizing the seriousness of the situation. He had heard rumors about this new form of Frieza, but now before his very eyes, the overwhelming energy of that power was confirmed. Frieza was far beyond any previous version of him that Goku had ever faced. The mere act of Frieza existing in this form caused the surroundings to tremble. However, Goku did not waver. His face remained firm, focused. He knew what he had to do. Without hesitation, he removed from his waist the small pouch that held the Dragon Balls he had recently collected. As Frieza boasted about his new power, Goku opened the pouch and the Dragon Balls glowed brightly as they were exposed to the sunlight. It's time to see what I've achieved too, Goku muttered to himself, but loud enough for Frieza to hear. With a quick movement, Goku extended his hands and in an instant, the Dragon Balls began to merge with his body. The power they contained flowed through his veins and in the blink of an eye, Goku was enveloped in a glowing 
glowing golden aura. His brilliant white hair rose up and his transformation into Super Saiyan 10 was complete. The energy emanating from him was impressive, comparable to Frieza's own power in his most advanced form. Frieza's face was momentarily surprised. He had not expected Goku to have reached such a high level of power. However, his surprise quickly gave way to anger and competitiveness. He could not accept that the Saiyan he despised so much could rival him after all his training. Impressive, Goku, Frieza said, keeping the venom from his voice. But that won't change the fact that you will die today. Without giving any more time for words, Goku charged forward. Unlike the previous times when he had waited for the right moment to strike, this new transformation, Super Saiyan 10, made him cold, calculating, and ruthless. He had no interest in prolonging the battle or giving Frieza a chance to demonstrate his strength. In his focused mind, the goal was clear to finish Frieza off as quickly as possible. Goku's blows were precise, each one striking Frieza with devastating force. The battle between the two quickly escalated, with energy blasts and exchanges of blows that destroyed the surrounding terrain. The shockwaves created by their attacks reverberated through the atmosphere, creating storms and destroying mountains all around. Despite his new transformation and immense power, Frieza soon realized that he was being outmatched. Goku's unstoppable power in his Super Saiyan 10 form was something he hadn't expected. Even in his Black Frieza form, he couldn't keep up with Goku's precision and speed. Every time Frieza tried to counter-attack, Goku anticipated his moves, as if he already knew what he would do. This is impossible! Frieza shouted in frustration after being thrown to the ground with a punch straight to the chest. I trained to be the strongest in the universe! Goku, still impassive, stared down at him. He didn't respond to Frieza's taunts. He knew that with this transformation, his mind was free of unnecessary distractions and emotions. The battle was his only focus. Realizing that Frieza was vulnerable, Goku knew it was time to end this. He took a few steps back, raised his hands, and began charging his most iconic attack. <laughs> Frieza, seeing the imminent danger, tried to gather the last of his energy to counterattack, but it was too late. Goku's aura flared brightly and the power of the Kamehameha grew in his hands. With a swift movement, Goku launched the powerful blast of energy directly at Frieza. The force of the Kamehameha enveloped the tyrant, who screamed in fury and despair as he was completely consumed by the blast. In a matter of seconds, Frieza's body was disintegrated and the threat he posed was finally eliminated. Silence fell over the destroyed plane. Goku took a deep breath, feeling the calm that followed the battle. He knew he had done what was necessary to protect the Earth and his friends, but something inside him still made him wary. The power he had achieved with Super Saiyan 10 was incredible, but he also knew that this level of focus and coolness could come at a price. It was at that moment that Vegeta arrived at the scene, observing the destruction around him and, mainly, Goku's new form. The Saiyan Prince remained silent for a few moments, processing what had just happened. He knew that Goku had surpassed all his limits once again. So, Kakarot, you did it again, didn't you? Vegeta said with a sigh, crossing his arms. I'll have to train one more time to reach your level. Goku, still in his Super Saiyan 10 form, finally relaxed. He detransformed, returning to his base form, and a laugh escaped his lips. It's always like this, Vegeta, but I'm sure you'll catch up to me soon. Vegeta gave a slight smile, although he was still frustrated, and looked at the horizon. They both knew that. Although Frieza had been defeated, new threats would always arise. And when that happened, they would be ready once again to protect the Earth and the universe. Guys, this is how we end. Goku has finally achieved his most powerful transformation, which he called Super Saiyan 10. Did you like it? Do you think it's as powerful as Ultra Instinct? I commented. Don't forget to like and also subscribe to the channel. Bye!